the polls have all shown the opposition gaining support. Really, the last term of our last government, uh, the relationship between Labour and the farmers became quite strained. There's a, it's a bit of a mixed bag there. We've got a bit of work to do to win back some support in the rural communities. We, we will have a tax policy uh, you know, coming out probably next year. Um, and I think um, yeah, I think it is absolutely going to you know, deal with the issues that New Zealanders are concerned about. We, we want to make sure that whatever tax we come up, you know, whatever tax policy we come up with, it fits in with our broader plan to grow New Zealand's economy. And, um, capital gains tax is one of the options, and it's a, it's a pretty good one. Um, but there are other options out there as well. And I think the ones who are struggling to be constructive in government, frankly, are the ACT Party. So the treaty principles have been established already. They're established in, in law, effectively, through uh, the jurisprudence. Um, there's already ex- multiple examples of government departments and agencies working to, you know, to uphold the principles of the treaty. This bill shouldn't go to select committee because it will just bring out, um, the, frankly, the worst in New Zealand um, at, through a select committee process. Um, and we should be appealing to people's better natures, and we should be aiming to bring New Zealanders together rather than use this bill um, to, as a, to drive a wedge, to drive people apart, which is what David Seymour is trying to do. I think David Seymour is making the current government unelectable. I mean, he, his, his extreme views on things, the culture wars that he's fighting, and you've got Winston Peters fighting all sorts of culture wars as well. We had one term in government with Winston Peters, one was enough. Uh, none of us were keen to do it a second time around. The Greens, over the last you know six years that we were in government with them, is that they can be a very constructive partner in government. If you look at the progress that we made on a whole range of areas around the environment and climate change, when we dig up more coal and we burn more coal, we are literally burning the planet that sustains our life. Look at what's just happened with the Manawanui. It was a relatively new ship. It was a good ship. It was well maintained and it's just sunk. Um, do we want nuclear submarines? trawling around through the Pacific. And actually, the Māori Party, despite their rhetoric, they can also be a constructive partner in government. The polls have all shown the opposition gaining support.